Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the second 6G wireless summit. Corona is spreading as pan epidemia around the world, having consequences to all of us and our loved ones. We want to make our small effort in taking care of each of other by organizing this event now online. We are very sorry for all the trouble created to all registered participants all around the world. We are all together over 400. All of you are now hopefully safe at your homes, in your offices, and enjoying our technical program. We have more than 30 invited talks, 70 regular papers, as well as seven keynote presentations from leading industry and academia in our field. I really want to thank contribution from all of you. In particular, I want to thank our gold sponsors, Ericsson, Huawei, Keysight, Nokia Bell Labs and ZTE. Your support has been really amazing during quite difficult weeks when travel restrictions around the world started to hit us all. We also want to thank our silver sponsors, Rora Swartz and Virginia Diados. We also want to thank bronze sponsors in the digital and Wipro. Finally, I want to thank and give a big hand to our local organizers concerning technical program, exhibitions, white papers, publicity, logistics, finances, all of you who have been invisible behind 6G Summit email address. You are a, an amazing team. Thank you all. This year, our targets with the 6G Wireless Summit are really ambitious. We established earlier this year 12 thematic expert groups targeting at publishing rather detailed white papers on specific areas. Our white paper expert group's leaders will be presenting the current status of their work in their invited presentations. We are targeting to publish all these white papers by the end of April. Hopefully you will be enjoying the contents. Our 6G flagship program is still the only major global 6G research program. However, in other parts of the world, there are plans to make similar programs, like for example in South Korea, China and Japan. Uh, also within European uh, Union area, uh, different research groups are making proposals to commission on 6G flagship projects. Um, end of last year, World Radio Congress did not talk about 6G frequency band allocations yet. But uh, in the USA earlier last year, FCC granted experimental licenses for 95 gigahertz to 3 terahertz frequency regime. And those will lead to really exciting uh, experiments and research results. During the two first years of operation, our flagship has produced 800 international peer-reviewed publications. Out of those, 500 has, have been published jointly with our international collaborators. Uh, we have also produced 44 doctoral theses in various fields, and our white paper has been downloaded over 100,000 times so far. Last year, uh, accumulation of our work was about 300 many years. Currently, we have three core partners, Nokia Bell Labs, Keysight and Interdigital. We are currently also looking for new collaborators, both from industry and academia. Hello there. I'm reading a brand new 6C Waves magazine, biannual magazine that uh, gives highlights from our 6C flagship research. You will get your copy very soon and the online version is published today. The back cover of this issue tells that IEEE PIMRC 21 conference will be organized in September 21 in Helsinki with the theme 6G Driving Sustainability. See you all there.